Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2 on the Radio Man 03, and it is awesome to have you along. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? I'm literally picking up right where we left off. The trapper's right up there. Yeah. I'm thinking I might want to go do... There, there was a job we got way back in the at the beginning, and that was Hosea. Easy now. He, he had a proposition for us to help him with, and I've got to think it was more into the tutorial stage at that time. So maybe we should go over there and do that. I think we're down in an area where... Well, I don't know if we're be close to it. I want to say we are. Uh, it's over here. Is Hosea Matthews. So we're going to head over there. And uh, we'll see what kind of trouble, of course, we get along on the way. But I'm going to head that direction and see about uh, doing that because it was way back at the beginning when we first started. Some of the other missions now have moved forward a little bit. Uh, I, I got... Uh, Lenny came back in a hurry to tell us that Micah had been put in jail. He had been arrested for murder and put in jail. Uh, let me get my varmint rifle out. Keep my eyes open for a squirrel, hopefully. I know you're close. I feel you tickling my britches. There we go. What do we got here? What's this guy doing up here? Goddamn Chinaman, man. Tell me this map will have treasure. Oh, he's got a treasure map, does he? Yep. We've got a treasure map on us. We have two, actually. Actually, I guess we went and found Easy. one, huh? Let's go have a little chit-chat with him. We've got a treasure map. It looks like it's someplace behind Valentine. I just haven't taken the time to take you guys with me to go do it. Sweet juniper and boiled Satan, you scared me. Boiled Satan? Yeah, I get that a lot. So, what's that you got there? You ain't interested in no scrap paper. It's nothing. Just something for wiping and sniffing in the night. Yeah. Well, I got to go now. Hey, why the hurry, partner? I got a hot tail. Don't you follow me now. Look what we got here. I'm going to have to do... <laughs> I don't know if he... He doesn't seem to be wanting to give me any information. <laughs> so, I'm going to help myself to some information. Now then, let's see. Come on now, you gotta cut me loose. I'll let you. I'll, I'll let you. Isn't your day? Come on, you got your map. You'll be rich from it. Enough for a, a whole night with your favorite style. Think about it. Now let me go. Let me go. Hmm. Me, uh, you ain't gonna leave me like this. I'm gonna study your horse real quick. Doesn't look like I've done that yet. That's the Nakoda. There's your information on the Nakoda. Um, I believe they get out of these, so I'm going to go ahead and just leave him right there. Wrapped up. Come on, boy. And thank you for the treasure map. Well, I'll know where to find you. Easy, easy. Hi there, mister. <laughs> Draw attention to myself. All right. Oh, look at this. This looks pretty uh, forested in here, doesn't it? I think a shotgun might be a better weapon in here. Ah! Hmm. 
This is pretty cool, huh? Right through here. Look at this. It's so beautiful, man. The sounds, the lighting, all of it. Just so perfect. I don't want these guys thinking I'm doing anything weird. Keep your eyes open for that elk, too. Okay, you guys are going really slow. Out of the damn way! Exactly. God, you guys are like molasses over there. Pick another speed. Burrito likes to, uh, he likes to trot, likes to gallop. Actually, this is my favorite speed. <laughs> Lily May. Lily May. Lily May, you think you're so great. Good job. Running around. Nose in the air. Hold the hand with that dumb. Hold on, kid. You wait, Lily May. No. Well, someday, I'll show you. Hey, mister. I just want to be left alone, all right? What's the matter with you? You care about this girl? Stand up for yourself. She'll come around. Yeah? I've been waiting. That's it, huh? I'll be. Rich. Oh. A nice big house. You'll be begging me to court you. You got anything else? Oh. Holy May. Hmm. Oh. Maybe I'll just stay here forever. That doesn't sound like a good idea like at all. Like some fallen leaf, crinkle up. Wouldn't that be nice? Hmm. You're depressing, dude. Oh no, it's gonna be night time. I think I might lay down. Oh, we got a thunderstorm. Okay. Oh boy, that's not good. Um. If I know Dilly Dally, can I get to where I need to be? Quickly? Yeah. It's quite the building right there. Easy. Something kind of, some kind of, oh, was a riverbed? Is that a dried up riverbed right there, maybe? Some kind of uh, mining operation, it looks like. All right, let's let's stay on track. I'm trying to get to Hosea. You gotta help me out here, Mister. Oh yeah. Can you? Please. Sure. I've been on the run for days now. Uh, if you could help me with these shackles, I I just might have a chance. Easy enough. Oh, oh, oh yes. Yes! Perfect! Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I I got no money to give you, but I think I'm... Hey, what the hell? Get away from me! Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. Okay. <laughs> oh, I wish I hadn't done that. I accidentally pointed my gun at him. Yeah. It'll come along again, I'm sure. Hopefully. Okay, we are entering... New Hanover, Emerald Crossing. We should be able to locate our friend here, Hosea. An interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I hear him. Interesting very well. It's trusting. I don't do so. Here we go, folks. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work in the right way. Well, they all say that. I never met an idiot that called himself one. I should have slept true. till morning, huh? So we're not I doing something like this at night? 
Maybe I should ride up. Well, this has already started, kind of. Look at me. Why would I lie about this? I'm going for it. This is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. <laughs> I tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business. Come on, deal. Arthur. Let's what? Listen. He's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Okay. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Oh. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. Oh. By marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. <laughs> you heard the man. Let's go rob By his cousin. By marriage. By marriage. <laughs> okay. All right. Looks like it's going to be nighttime. Uh, sorry about that. Let's go do it, though. As bad as uh, Bandit Mask could be. Uh, 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 Hosea. Hosea. I'm walking right here next to you. Do you he is trying to run me over. Really? Really. Lead the way. He said the place is just north. Hold on, buddy. Westy here. Watch out. Me? The other one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. No, I, I have not been gallivanting around out here. Okay, then I need to take care of myself. Oh, I ate the canned peaches. I didn't mean to eat the canned peaches. I'll eat that piece of cheese, though. I'm working on it, man. You need to take it easy, buddy. You just need to really take it easy. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money for us. I guess you're That's right. nice. That would be Come nice. On. It's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. <laughs> Go on! By marriage. Oh man, this is beautiful at night out here. I've got to think there's probably different stages for the moon, maybe? Maybe not. So far, being out at night, though, I've, I've noticed I can see pretty well. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. I agree. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. There's 
Where's the house? Yeah, I, I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Mm-hmm. What kind of peeps we got here? We're not supposed to kill anybody, right? Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Yeah, this is like a tutorial thing here, almost. Look at the home. Mm-hmm. You see anyone? Nope. Okay. I reckon we could do it now. Sneak in, and I'll get the coach. You can try the house. Or wait until morning when I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. While you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Hmm. The day one sounds kind of fun. Morning. Let's wait. Let's wait. We're going to see what's in the house and get the stagecoach. All right. Okay. <laughs> Let's get on with this, Mr. Mm. Morgan. Yes. <clears throat> Let me head up there and make a fool of myself. <laughs> with pleasure. Just don't get caught. Because it's me, they'll shoot first. <clears throat> Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. He's going up to almost to the front door. My good man, my good young man. Fare thee well, fare thee well. <laughs> is your father home, son? Sure is. Get him down here, please. Get him down here. Get lost, mister. I was lost for many years. I was, and you know what? Oh, <laughs> here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. Are you selling something, partner? Free. Spinal alignment. What? Spinal alignment. The Lord God Almighty, or whomever built it. Our brain's in here, but our soul is in our back. You, sir, your, your back looks kind of tricky. How sure. Here we go. I'm all quiet. I'm just being sneaky. Six. Fifty-one. He said money, right, in the house? Never happened. Seriously, it's all about the spine. We think our brain is in our head, but they are in our backs too. Oh, he's right there. Oh, I can tell you're a very wise man, but the troubles. Is that better? Just a bit. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a little bit better. Uh, uh. This session has been free, but perhaps I might call again. How much will it cost me? I'm offering you virility, and you're asking me about money, sir. I ain't made of money, Mr. My rates are reasonable. Have a think about it. All right, let's go get that wagon. This way next. Bye. Gentlemen. Can't hear anything over the train. I 
I don't see anybody in the field. Yeah, wagon's definitely inside of here. Oh, Jesus, Jose, you're right here. Get on, dear boy. I'm working on it, buddy. Let's see if there's anything in here. Come on. Get on and let's head back. Yep. We're fine. Yep. Damn it. I think you should have been more careful. What are you yeah, talking about? Sorry. I must have left a chest open. No, I didn't. I guess I'll settle down. So what were you able to lift from the house? Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred. Not too bad. Not bad at all. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. <laughs> it wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye. And as usual, he did not flinch. <laughs> exactly. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Not sure. Until we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. I hope it's not stashed in town like we did in Blackwater. Even if we had to dump the money from the ferry, we could have at least got the rest out if it was hidden someplace else. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. <laughs> Park that thing in here. Quickly. I'm working on it. There it is. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. Okay, so this guy will sell camp, coaches, huh? Coming? I wonder which ones are worth it. Um, no, I'm not going back nah, to camp. I'll catch up with you later. Okay. Stay out of trouble. Right on. Oh, we're almost up to 400 bucks. What is that all about? Long time, boy. You can now sell stolen wagons to see us at the wagon fence in Emerald Ranch. Okay, now the next thing I'd like to do with you guys today is open up. There's the lily millet thing. We're going to do that at a different time. I want... This is actually a long ways away, actually, huh? There's a town over this side that I need to go to to get a fence open. Uh, I'm going to put a beacon... Well, is that right? I guess that's good. You can speak with people in the area to find out where the debtor is. This must be another job type of thing we could do. I'm going to keep moving because I wanted to find a fence for sure. Uh -oh. It's always got to be such a goddamn performance with you. Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week. 
and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I Lily. Where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. Well, here we go. Oh, this is a pay job. I, I forgot about that. It right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder. Oh, boy. Lily's debt money. Oh, look at that little fancy hat right there. Hey, you know what I'd do to thieves? Law here about this. I didn't steal that. It's a debt. Oh, damn it. Leave me alone, won't you? You've got the debt. What do you want? Oh, boy. We got a witness. I didn't commit a crime. He actually hit me first. What did you witness? <laughs> Let's put it. Let's let's take. Help! Help! I need help! Oh, they're witnessing me assault this guy too. I don't see any more witness stuff going on here, though. Easy there. Looks like he's uh, had enough. I think we're okay. I don't think we're uh, in trouble anymore. Oh, he died. <laughs> okay, or he's unconscious, one of the two. I'm thinking he's probably dead, though. Oh boy, we got some. We got we 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 got in trouble with that one there. Back to the map. Uh, Emerald Station. Okay, so I need to go out. I'm going to try to just go out over here. Let's just go out that way and see what's out there. Because I don't have a clue. Yet. Yeah. Isn't that weird? Look at that. Now, is that too much gun for a fox? I don't know. Might be. That might be the wrong weapon. It was a headshot, so let's see. Nope, that's good. Okay, Springfield will work on the uh, fox as well. I just noticed the carbine rifle was causing, I think, too much damage. I think it might be too big for the deer. I could be wrong. But it, it felt that way. There's a nice little fox pelt. We'll take that back to camp with us. I don't think we've had one of those yet. Oh, wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's, that's my sign. That's what I'm looking for. Why wouldn't you use the road sign? Emerald Ranch, Van Horn, and Annisburg. I think it's Annisburg is where we're going. Let's go this way. Let's see if we can open up Annisburg. At least visit it so we know that... I think that's where there's a fence. That's not going to be a good shot. Yeah. That's running off. Easy now. 
Anything special about this dead tree right here? I found a wind chime, or a, I, I should say a dream catcher in a tree. The tree had several dream catchers in it, and I drew it in my journal. And I found a cabin with a bunch of dead people in it. And it looked like they uh, were all part of some sort of a cult, maybe, and uh, drank the Kool-Aid. Easy, easy. That's gorgeous right there. What kind of wildlife we got down here? So far, it's the same stuff that we've been seeing. What's this here on the right? Slow up now. Oh, wow. Looks like we got a tree cutting operation going on here. Making lumber. Or they're just clearing some land. Oh, it looks like rail work. Railroad. Yeah. Yeah, there's a trellis over there. Trestle, I should say, not a trellis. <clears throat> Again, looking for the fence. That was my goal today. Find out where the fence is so I know where it is when I need to go get it. Why does this feel like a really long way around? <laughs> it seems... I don't know. This seems different. What's this? Oh, look at you. Bullshit you was. Oh, there's two of you. Hold up. Uh-huh. Oh, that is it. Oh, my God. Okay. Up you go. Up you go. Could have done much better. Look at that. Go to help somebody. And they bushwhack you. Ooh, that guy had 20, almost 20 bucks on him. What do you got? What's he got down here? He's got a carbine repeater. And a Warren Springfield. Okay. Yeah, most of the weapons line up with ours. I guess there's a few specialty guns that you can find. Um, I think the uh, Micah's got a pair. Right oh, <coughs> hey, 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 whoa. We like a good scrape, don't we, cousin? Up in these hills? Okay, fella. Everything yeah. is ours. <laughs> Easy. You're okay. Where the heck were these guys? Oh, I see them. Oh, God. He, dude, that's some good shot. Those are some good shots right there.
Oh, there's a wagon over here. I see it. I think it was just the two of them, maybe. Damn it! Hey, now we're coming for you. What do these hicks think they're up to anyway? Get on quick! Oh, you're running for real now! Murphy Brood. Okay, so a couple of them took off. Is that what I'm getting right there? Oh, look at this. We got all kinds of food. Hold on. Can't seem to grab that stuff. I think I, I might be full up on it. That's open already. New plant. <laughs> the golden crant. Okay. Found another herb. It should show up on the map too. There's a purple one right here too as well. Let's grab this one. I've been selling them. Look at there, got into a gunfight. So we picked up, we found a new clan, didn't we? Uh, look at that, Fox was coming over here to start eating this guy. These guys, they don't even wear boots or nothing. Just like some kind of deliverance moment or something. Come on, freeloader. Where are you, buddy? That boy. Yep. You're good. Okay, beautiful. He had time to rest. Got his stamina all back. Let's continue on. We were attacked by a new gang. I believe that was a gang. The Burry Gang, right? Or something like that. Everything up on these hills they own. I don't doubt that for a second. This doesn't look like the way to get to Annisburg. Maybe it is. Yeah, lumber industry. Look at this. This is cool. Mining and coal... Co oh, okay. So there is a... In the game, we've picked up a couple of notes on Cornwall's train when we raided his train. And I've read those letters. And... Cornwall and this Jameson mining are kind of thinking about teaming up together to pool their industries. Cornwall is in oil and this guy is in the coal. So that's what they're doing. They're they're talking about that and I found letters related to that. Tennessee Walker 
Are they both Tennessee Walkers? It's a beautiful white Shire right there. Hello. Uh, hi, how you doing? Uh, okay, so is this a town? Or is this just a, a, a mine? Van Horn is down that way. Is this all the mine? I'm missing something. Here, here's some storefronts over here. Just coming at it the wrong way. Okay, those guys were armed with rifles, and they were looked uh, quite surprised to see me. Here's Annisburg. Okay, so all we've got is a, really a depot, a nice depot at that. Lancaster, Lancaster guns and ammunition. Never listen to me. It's like talking to a goddamn wall. I ain't leading, so why are you following? Uh, it's. What do you mean? Why am I following you? <laughs> because we're all going into town. Silly man. Can I not hitch this horse? No, 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 no. Don't go up on the railing. Why did you not... No prompt to... Uh... There we go. Maybe you can't do that one there? What's in here? <laughs> Nothing I can go see. I thought there was a fence this town. Uh, this seems shady to me. Schneider's store. Let's go check Schneider's store over here. Get across these tracks before we get hit by a train. There's more up there. Look at all those stairs up there. That's cool. General store says closed. Oh. Well. There's like guards everywhere. You must be new around here. Welcome. I have a good selection of quality weaponry in the catalog here. And anything you like, I can bring out for you. Okay, so he's got uh, the catalog he can customize, and he has lodging as well here. Is his catalog any different than the uh, other guy? Let me see. Revolvers, pistols, repeaters, it all looks kind of the same in, the, in this regard here. Double action revolver. We've got the Cattleman. The Showfield is what I'd like to get my hands on, but it's locked right now. We need more skills. It looks to me like it's about the same. Okay, so we've got a all store. Right. Take your time, Detective. You won't find better quality Deep, elsewhere. Let's go to the map. 
What do we have so far? We got a gunsmith, we got a stagecoach, we got the post office. There's the post office. Evening. Evening. There's some track housing back there, but I don't see any other storefronts. So you got the store itself. I thought there was a Fence here. Ooh, the water looks nasty. That is not good at all. But that's. I bet that burns. Well, I'm mistaken. It's not here. There's no fencing operation here where I could sell those rings and stuff. Well, what's this here? Maybe it's just the time of day. Reliable refrigerated service. This looks like this is a booth that's probably open. <laughs> I'm gonna set up camp outside of town. That's fire. Uh oh. Mind if I warm my bones? Not again. Y'all knew this was Murphy Hills. You should be careful where you're camping. I can look after myself. Besides, it's a free country. Free country? <laughs> no. Everything bought and paid for. <laughs> and we don't protect what's ours. Y'all be careful where you wander. Come on. Let's go. I think you got the message. Well, I got the message all right. I'll Buster. kill you next time. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let me get up. Get up. Get up! Come out of camp where I want to! Come on! He was warned! You Yeah, we're back. All right, we slept the night away. What? Now, let's get down here on this trail. There is a town just south of Annisburg. Whoa, easy. I think it's called Rhodes. I think it's down in. Let's see. There's Annisburg. I'm gonna go down this way and see what happens. It looks like it's going to take us along the edge of the map, which would be great. We can open it up, but I'm going to go down there, and I th there, that's where there's a fence. Right now, uh, Annisburg does not have a fence and, and won't have a fence. But uh, that's what we're looking for. That's going to be kind of the end of the episode today, is we've got to get down there and see if we can find one. So we'll take a look and see. Uh, maybe I should try to... I feel like I should be going after some of these squirrels. I've got small arrows on me. That's a level two. I know you need a perfect squirrel for one of these talismans coming up. Yeah. Careful, little squirrel. So, Annisburg is our um, lumber town, for sure. Lumber is their trade here in Annisburg. That's cool. Look at that. Look at that barrier put up there to hold back the, the uh, mountainside. That's awesome. Now that they've cut all the trees out of there. Yeah. All right, I'm headed south. I'll bring you back if something interesting happens, which this, it's always does. Always does. <laughs> Look at the deer coming by. Okay, then. Oh, got a oh my gosh, look what you've stepped in. Uh disarm trap. Help me. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Keep pulling. I can feel it getting loose. Oh, 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 I screwed that up. My leg. Oh, what have you done? I'm so sorry. I tried to get that off of you. Uh, uh. Oh, God, he's dead. He bled out. Oh, no, I screwed that up. Well, sorry about that, buddy. Potent predator bait. Uh-oh. We're getting a, a minus thing on that, huh? I tried to help him. I did. He doesn't need these things anymore. Poor guy. I bet that would have helped, too, if I'd gotten that off. <laughs> Oops. Sorry, buddy. Nice little passenger train, huh? Taking people from here to there. That's what they do. People from here to there. Mm-hmm. This should take us right down there to it. Uh, anything else, I guess I could follow the tracks, huh? There's all kinds of little cabins along here and stuff I should probably poke my head into. Okay, we are in Van Horn. Let's go to the map. I didn't have to travel as far as I thought you did, huh? There is a question mark here, so we will just reset our marker for there. We'll pick that up while we're here. You don't have to do those again. You can do them anytime you want to, as far as I know. I'm pretty sure that's the case. I say that without really knowing, but I, you know, the game pretty much we're at our own pace at the moment right now. Easy. Just thought maybe there might be something around these dead trees. Unique things like that is something to take a look at and stop and look at. Sometimes you'll find things by these trees. And I found a tree in the forest that's like split by lightning or something, and it had me uh, draw it in my journal. I believe I drew it in my journal. Let's go to our map and see what we have here. We have a hotel, we've got a post office. There's our fence right there at the end of this pier. Hey, mister. Morning, mister. Mister? Morning. Can I not uh, hitch a horse out here? <clears throat> oh, wait a second. I see a spot right back here. Hold on. I like to hitch my horse when I come into town. I just like to slide off and, and go running. Oh, he can't quite get through here. This is Van Horn Depot. There we go. There we go, perfect. Okay, here's the depot. We're looking for the fence, because I want to get rid of this gold bar and some of this other stuff that we've earned, we've found. Let's see if we can calm this dog down. Hey, boy. Got a new dog here. Hello, boy. Mangy blue tick coon hound. <laughs> I can't do nothing else with you, huh? You just gonna sit there and wag your tail? Can I come up and pet you? Yeah, you good boy. There we go. Hey, boy. Hey there, you're not mangy. Oh, he's, oh you look hungry. You got, I can see your ribs. Poor guy. All right, let's see about this fence in this here town. If you're looking for a game that's got a ton of detail in it, you can't go wrong. The Van Horden Trading Post. Uh, hey there, partner. Morning, fella. Morning, fella. Silas Crawford. 
Silas Crawford tinned and dry goods and many other useful articles. Let's see if there's anything around the side here or the back that we need to be aware of since we're here. Look at the shutter move with us. Trying to refrain from falling in the water. Oh, there's somebody laying out here. This is kind of strange. Morning to you. Good day. Oh, she seems okay. I can't seem to catch a break today. You and me both. You and me both, she says. All right, let's take a look and see what we got going on in the fence. How much money can we make with a gold bar? You new in town? Don't think I've met you before. I am new in town. Let's uh, sell. Sure, let's take a look then. Uh, gold wedding rings. I have three of them. Fifteen each, huh? I wonder if I should hold on to one. That's what I never know about. So, the, the gold bar, 500 bucks. We're selling it. Sure. There I'll it is. Uh huh. Amazing inventions card number 10. We're not going to sell that. Kentucky bourbon. We should keep those. I'm going to sell the, sell the pocket watches. Just came across this somewhere, huh? Mm, I did. And the coffee, I'm going to sell that too because so far I've not made coffee. I imagine eventually I'm going to. Now, here's a small jewelry bag. Is this something? It looks like I've picked up two so far. So I'm wondering if it's even something I need. The gold pocket watch, I'll sell it and sell it. This is your business, not mine. That gold nugget, um, yeah, I'll sell that too. Look at us, we're almost to a thousand. Silver emblem ring, we've got a pearl necklace. One of five. Mm. Platinum band, a valuable platinum band can be sold for cash. I'm going to sell that silver buckle mm. clamp. Don't need to know where you got this. The silver earring I'm going to keep because that looks really unusual. That's a, that's a sp platinum spring bracelet. God, some of this stuff I feel like I shouldn't be selling. This is the Native American ring, an ornate ring of Native American origin. This is, I guess it says this is a unique item at the very bottom, huh? Where these don't say that. So I'm going to go ahead and sell those. It looks to me like I'll be getting more. This doesn't say it's a unique item, so I'm going to sell those bags. Platinum spring bracelet. I'm going to put some of this cash into our coffer back at the camp. This doesn't say it's a special item. You don't need to know where you got this. This doesn't say that. That actually, you know what? This doesn't say it either. It doesn't say that's a special item. I'm going to hold on to it though. Platinum pocket watch that was given to me. I've never, I never use it, so I'm going to sell it. Very nice, this. Platinum I'm band. Sure the previous owners prefer that I look after it now. Uh-huh. And then the platinum band. I'm gonna sell that too. Hey, what's this? Phone sitting on a bench somewhere, I suppose. The usual story. Aren't you a friendly little fella? Alright, we're coming out of here with one thousand sixty-eight dollars. Now let's see what he sells as well. The High Roller Revolver. It's locked. Dynamite, 90 cents per stick. Throwing knives at 225. Well, they're grayed out. What is this all about? It's, it's, it's grayed out. I got, I've got too many on my inventory. That's what it is. Dynamite. Stick of dynamite. Carry one of eight dynamite. I guess I could grab some of those. That's what he has, though, huh? A cleaver. There's some baked beans, canned peas. Okay, so he's got some food items in here. Herbivore bait, moonshine, predator bait, gun oil. I'm actually going to take a couple of gun oils. Gun? Oh, I got one. Okay, so we, what does it say? I've got oh, five of five gun oil. I'm I guess I've been picking those up. Maybe I shouldn't buy those anymore. A lock breaker. So, any idea what you're looking for? I'm just looking. Executioner hood. Hides your identity while committing crimes. The canvas sack hood. The metal skull mask. The psycho mask. The poison arrow pamphlet. Oh, uh, 52.20, huh? The homie tomahawk pamphlet. Okay, so these are things we're going to want to buy and then make. Special bitters. 
Interesting. Okay, so there's a few pamphlets here. I think the other thing we need to remember is he's got mass and he's got a this lock breaker is probably going to be important eventually. But I'm going to hold off on that so we can further upgrade our horse and, and ourselves and camp and stuff. A general store, nor some of these goods neither. That's for sure. Nobody's missing this too much. All right, buddy. Thank you for your uh, purchase of everything. I got five, so it was what was five hundred dollars for the gold bar. That's a pretty good deal. Thank you. All right, and that is going to conclude the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share on the Radio Man 03. Have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.